Okay, yard sailing is over for the day. We are now at an estate sale that looks to be quite opulent. Look at this, J.S. Elcano. Oh, I see a table full of glass. Let's go look. I am gonna get a closer look here of some of these things on the wall. There's something in them. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Okay, yard sailing is over for the day. We are now at an estate sale that looks to be quite opulent. Opulent, that's a good word, isn't it? Yeah. Opulent. Okay. Uh, so we just got dropped off because you cannot pull in the gates with a vehicle. So we're walking in and uh, it should be half off now because it is afternoon. Yes. So we're gonna go in and see what goodies we might be able to find at a bargain. I'm not so sure about this one, but then you never know. So what are we gonna do? Ha! Let's get shop done. Let's get shop done. All right. Oh, are we being dumped? Is he dumping us? He says, forget it, I've had enough of this. I was gonna find the nearest boot box. All right. We don't have too far to go. It's right up there. Oh, look, it's stay sale. Let's go, we're at the right place. We're going in. Ooh. Anybody remember where that's from? I am hitting the garage first. I always hit the garage last, but you know what? It's not too busy out here, so let's uh, let's come out here first and see what we can find. Right off the bat, I see these little wood, huh? little wood tulips. Why do I like those so much? There's no price on that. All right, all right, Danny, come on, think bigger, think bigger. Look for something better. Got some cookware. Oh my gosh, there's gonna be some gorgeous furniture here. You know I zeroed in on him. All right. Let's keep going, let's keep going. Oh, these are nice. I love those. Twisted stems. I'm the niche lady. YouTube? You watch YouTube? Oh. You don't advertise anything, do you? That's me. This is a Kaiser West Germany bowl. We'll see how much that one is. Let's see. Come over to this side. I'm trying to get an idea of how much that might be based on some of the other dishes here. None of these got priced though. So we'll find out. We'll find out. It's down here. Alright, All right, let's go inside where the good stuff is. I do love these tapestry chairs. I would have a house full of those if I could get away with it. Look at this, J.S. Elcano. Quite a statement piece. Oh, I see a table full of glass. Let's go look. All right. So this is that uh, Reuven glass, I do believe here. This one's got a label. And it says something. Let's find one that I can read the label. Let's see if one of them is real. There we go, by Ayal. So that's 11 pieces. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I guess they're counting lids as 11 pieces. Um, let's find out if they're half price because I would definitely do half price on those. 
Let's see, I've got to find somebody to just make sure that we are at half price time. Find somebody who works here. Let's look at that piece. If it's half price for $3, I'm definitely getting that too. That looks like Blanco to me. They made this kind of hobnail, big hobnail stuff. You can tell it's hand blown by the pontle there. There's no price on this piece unless there's something else that goes with it. But I don't see anything else that goes with it. So, unless, no, nope, that's a bag. No, nope, I don't, I, we'll find out how much that one is too. Look at these monkeys, oh my gosh. so much amazing artwork in here. Mm, walls and walls of it. I am going to get a closer look here of some of these things on the wall. Little, little dainty pieces of art. Look at her. I mean, she's just cool. I mean, in the caliber of the items in this house tells me that this is probably a very, very good piece. Here's another one. I think I'm going to go ahead and... Well, that one's... It's just plastic, though, so I think I'll maybe leave that one. I, want, I would wish I could find something else like this, but I don't see any. Oh, look at all the horsies. And the birdies. Oh goodness, I have some decisions to make. I think she already has some of these. These are like Blanc de Chien horses. They're really super nice. There's like, see, one, two, three, four. What the, I'm not counting him because his leg is broken. Five, six, seven. So there's seven without broken legs. And it would be $12 at half price for all of them. Oh gosh, you know what? I, I think I'm going to leave them just because there's so many chips. There's so many chips. But you know, I'm going to grab this little guy. He's a nice, he's pink. I'm trying to get the color to come through. He's actually a pink. So we're going to definitely grab him. And let's see who else we have to grab. This one is very interesting too. He's not priced. This guy. Hmm. It's really, really hard to try to be good. I've just got so much stuff. I mean, I just got so much stuff at the yard sales this morning too. I'm gonna just really try to be a little bit more discriminating. Hmm, what to do? Okay, I'm still gonna think about some of these. But for now, I'm just grabbing this one. Let's see what's in the closets. Oh wow, that's quite, that's quite frilly and lacy. <laughs> Look at that. Definitely vintage. Trying to see what that says. B. Merlin Castell. I'm not even quite sure what that is, but it's it's kind of awesome. I don't know how much the clothes are though. I'm gonna grab that. I have a friend. Actually, I have a couple of friends who do vintage clothing, and I will probably offer this to one of them. This is a nice bright room. That's a print. Didn't you want to look at these clothes? Mm. Mm. Yeah, like jumps in a bit. Yeah, please, thank you. My hand hurts. More this way. It's the bathroom. 
Never underestimate the bathrooms. Some vintage stuff, but not really what I'm looking for. Oh my gosh, here is another whole closet over here. Wow. My goodness. Oh, the glass? <laughs> It was nice too, it was a set. <laughs> yeah, 11, well it's actually nine pieces. I don't count lids as pieces. These are really cute. There's a, like a name on there and I can't make it out. I just got this one. Peek, peek, peek. You finding good stuff? Oh. It's missing a shelf. That it's is okay. so 80s. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much in this house that is so 80s. Oh, this Let's see what his mark is. Oh, it's not. I got fooled. That's actually a really good uh, Hummel reproduction. Oh, look, another headlamp. Noah's kind of into the headlamp thing now. Now that we used one at the uh, swap meet last night. What does that say? Ganny Mawad. I don't know. I'm just so not a designer girl, I don't know the designer names. little kitchen mushroom thing. <laughs> mm. That little rocking chair. It's very sweet. Oh my gosh, look at all the doilies. Look at all the doilies. Oops. Always look under stuff. You never know what you're going to find. Is that Royal Worcester? No. It's Banana Quit in <laughs> Panama. All right. It's going to be 50 cents. You know I got to get it. What is this guy? Oh, he's looking at his little reflection in the in the water. That's that's fun. Okay. I got to get him too. And because I got that guy, I got to get this guy uh, just so I have like a lot to sell because it's not really high end. But look how sweet that is anyway. All right. Grabbing that too. Let's see what we got in this little closet here. These are pens. Okay. You just have to uh, uh, check it, sir. Make sure everything is good and it works because, you know, we don't do returns, you know what I mean? So you have to... Uh, <laughs> Stephen Lennon. I just saw this said calendar towel. It's never been out of the box. It'll be a dollar. I don't know what the date is on it. But look at that. It's never been it's never been taken out of the box. And it's the little window kitty. Alright, grabbing that too. What are you? It's just a Always like a notepad. Okay. Good 
goodness gracious, there's a lot of stuff in this house. Oh, look how cute that jacket is. I love, oh my gosh, Jordan. Where's Jordan when I need her? Because she would love some of these clothes. She's actually going to be here in two days. That doesn't help me now. Oh, some of these clothes, look at them. I know a lot of people don't like real fur coats and I would never ever in a million years buy one brand new, but I can respect the vintage ones and the ladies who wore them. There's lots of bathrooms in this house. Lots of bathrooms in this house. Vintage linen. This is a beautiful piece. It would be $32 for that on the little stand. Oh, my problem is I have trouble selling those. <laughs> this is the size shell that the, uh, the new hermit crab would need, but new hermit crab is not staying with us. Yes, yes. I think I updated on my last video that uh, we had some personality conflict between him and Jack, and we love Jack, so. So Sebastian will have to find a new home. I suspect that's why he was at that store back. He was a turn-in from somebody else's tank, and I suspect it's because, well, he's a bad boy. He needs, like, his own little domain. Look at this little sewing cabinet. It'd be 20 bucks for that. Oh my goodness. It's, it's probably 20 bucks with all the stuff in it too. Oh, it needs a little work. It needs a little work. I mean, it's totally worth it, but I am not one to put work into things. Just not enough hours in the day. I love these Paris prints. These are not even with glass over them now. Most of the artwork I'm finding is all prints, not, not any originals. I've sent uh, Crystal of Rosie's Closet a text because she does vintage clothes and she's not too far from here and I think she would have a ball shopping here. So hopefully she can show up and find some cute things. Look how cute that is. Oh. Focus, Danny, focus. Ooh, I see ya. Tablecloth. Oh, oh, look at it. It's never been out of the package. It says Krashina. Six piece set Easter. It looks like a tablecloth though. How is it? Oh, I guess the other pieces were probably taken out. Put that right there for ten dollars. Yes. Hmm. It's one of those blankies with the the silky little sleeves on it. Lots of clown art here. Not a fan. Silver plate. I don't get too much in the silver plate. Oh, I wish that had its saucer. It's really pretty, but it doesn't. I think I will pout like these guys. Look at this little teeny tiny box. So sweet. A little leather wrapped horse. I think this is his price tag, which would make him six bucks. So 
I think we will get him for six bucks. This is a little enamel on copper. Since it's half price, that is a price that I love. And I will pick that up for six bucks. Oh, I see something else really nice. Look at this piece. I love unsigned pottery that has a quality look and feel because these can be your absolute sleepers. So for $7.50, I'm gonna figure out who done that. I will probably contact George the Antique Nomad on this one, send him some good pictures, have him help me figure it out. Oh, wait, 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 oh, oh. No, that was just a hair. It wasn't a crack. Ooh, I got scared there for a minute, but nope, we're gonna grab that. And I saw this one. I don't like this one nearly as much, even though it's got a bird on it. I'm not, I, the muted kind of color is not, not something that I really, really like. He's cool, but he's got some damage. See what's up on the wall here. I think there's like some little sleepers here, like a little wall pocket. Moran, 83. That right there, I think, is worth every penny of four dollars. I will grab it. These are all prints. All right, we are in the kitchen. Ooh, that's quite a heavy piece. This matches that vase that I got the other day. Thank you very much. All right, I will see you soon. Okay. Hi. We got more stuff. Look at that. I got it on. Let's see what we got. I am just scouring the counter for something to kind of jump out and grab me. So far, not so much. Are these Royal Wooster? No, still not Royal Wooster. They're from Israel. There's only three. That's a really, really cute lamp. You see what I see, right? We've got the little pedestal with the two froggies. Definitely getting him. And then we've got this guy. I imagine he's probably priced about the same. Oh, there it is. I told, told you it'd be priced about the same. Now this one's twelve. I'm not. I'm not as enamored with the ones that have the little mud men on them. So I think I'm probably gonna leave that one. Keep looking. Oh, nope. got my basket sitting over against the wall just because it's getting heavy and it's full of breakables. At least it'll, there's something in them. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's like tea. Oh, look at that cake. What are you? Little wooden, huh? little wooden things. Okay. PGA, oh, that's an interesting mark on that guy. That's kind of awesome, but it's a plate. Ooh, that is screaming Art Deco right there. Imperial Nippon. Oh, that is just screaming Art Deco. I will grab that for 11.
That one's pretty stunning too. Let me pull that one over here. See that swan. I'm sure this is hand painted also. Again, yep. Hand painted Nippon. It's probably a Noritake that looks like the Noritake mark. Nippon simply means Japan. Um, so Oh, just a super beautiful piece for $12. Yep, I'm going to grab that one too. Now, decisions. Do I want to pay $12 for this one? It is also Imperial Nippon. It's in really great shape. Yeah, you know what? I think I, think I will. I think I'll pay $12 for that one as well. And I looked over and I spotted this one. Now, this one doesn't have the Moriage on it, but it's got this guy. And I'm sure it's hand painted. Yeah, hand painted. Nippon. Again, twelve dollars. I must have it. Just that. It's like a little raised. I don't know if you can see. It's like little, little stones make the design on that. That is really interesting. Oh, I actually have one of these already listed. And uh, I've already done the research. I already know all about this. It's, um, it's a Bacchus mask made in Italy. It's fantastic. That's, yeah, that's my stack. I am gonna grab him for 10 bucks too. Oh, he's a bell. He's a bell. He's not signed. I wish he was signed. It's a Gibson. It's an interesting little piece. It is a signed piece. You know what? I'll pick that up for $3 as well. Oh, how gorgeous this one is. I do believe that's a on copper for six dollars. Uh, yes, we'll grab that too. All right, all right. Okay, let's go with these. More this way. Ooh, let's go outside. Ooh, at least we got some nice bright lighting out here. Are those all fake flowers? No, 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 no. I must, I must steer clear of all the fake flowers. I do like the little, little table though. Ooh, another bench. Frogs, lots of frogs. I don't see any turtles though. No turtles, just frogs. Oh, what a pretty pool. Oh, it's got a fountain. I want to go home and go in the pool. I really do. I think our pool's getting a little cold. I got to turn the heater on. Let's see. Anything over on this side? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, I think we just got to the room with all the really, really high end goodies. Oh, look at all that silver overlay glass. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, look, I just bought one of these last week. Actually, I think I bought it from them, too. Oh, this one's a lot more than the one I bought last week. Oh. Pretty, pretty, pretty things. Ooh. Look at these. So, when you find these, you usually just find the glass piece, right? You just take note of this because these were meant to go in a holder. Um, these are small for brides' baskets. I'm not sure the original purpose of these, and I say these because there's a second one over here. Oh, gosh, those are stunning but I still think at 40, that's a little more than I can do as a reseller, but it's a great price. Let's see if these are priced. 
don't see a price on these. I hate asking prices too, because then I seem cheap. And I don't want to seem cheap. More sets of china. Always more sets of china. Oh my gosh, it's got all the boxes too. Look at this table full of silver overlay glass. Wow, that's probably the biggest collection I've seen all in one spot. Like ever, ever. Now I'm intrigued by this because it's got the base. But I don't know if that ace is actually meant to go with that piece. Now that I look at it, look, that's just like a piece sitting. That is not meant to go in there. Do they have this price separate? So this would be for a bride's basket. Now, I don't know if they are selling it with, like they have this piece sitting in there, but that's, that is definitely not the piece that goes with that. No, 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 no. So I might ask them how much just this piece would be. It's probably got a mark under here somewhere. It does, it does, it's right there. I can't quite make it out, but you know what? I think Harleen said she had a loop. Okay, it's quadruple plate, we figured that out. I bought, I bought a bunch of trinket box from them last week. So I'm good on trinket boxes, and I'm good on trinket boxes based on what I found at that Estates or that yard sale this morning too. Just pretty stuff, but little single pieces and again another day. I may have picked that kind of stuff up but today. I'm already kind of overwhelmed with the amount of stuff I have to deal with in my garage. I'm gonna be gone all week. So there is that. Ooh, look at this blue piece. I thought this is like a Costa Boda or I don't know. It's got the duck. It's got the etch. I've never seen one in blue. And you know what? I think the blue is absolutely fabulous. So I am going to grab that. I see a little gem tree here. Let's see how much that is. Gosh, darn it. It's not marked. I'm going to have to ask. We have some glowy glass with silver overlay for nine dollars. We're grabbing that. P with the big S and the C O. All right, so she got out the loop. P now the loop was not good. I needed this. Oh, she got the magnifier out. Yeah. P S P S Company. Company C O quadruple plate. Quadruple plate, and then underneath four nine seven. It's nice. All right, I, I think I might actually have a, a glass piece that will fit it's a pretty the correct piece to fit in that really? yeah nice yeah hopefully they give me a good price on it i think they had it with like one of those glass pieces that didn't match oh is this no it's studio nova i'm kind of enamored with the grapes why am i such a weirdo <laughs> what does that say wind blood birds more birds I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the birds we've got plenty of birds right now what are these those are really odd I don't know what to think about those it's very interesting <gasps> what what look at I think it's a snail. He's a crystal snail. Oh my goodness. And he's silver plate and he's six dollars. Ah, uh, he's mine. This is Russian lacquerware, I do believe. That would only be eight dollars. Come on. Come on. That's amazing for eight dollars. Yes, I'll take it. Then I just spotted another one. Now this one isn't quite as fabulous as the first one, and the lid's not wanting to go on this one. Ooh. Yeah, that one, that one not as good, not as good. I'm gonna stick with this one. 
hand painted Heron Hungary. So two pieces. Oh, it's these two pieces would be 22. That's something I'd have to look up. I'd have to look it up. I might do that. Hold on to this. I got another. Ooh, that one's a little brutal. No, I don't. I don't like what I'm seeing there. But I like the penguin. See, I'm not liking him as much as I like the other one. I gotta tell you. All right. We got some more cut to clear pieces. Oh, that's a candle made in Russia. Oh, it's Russian glass. Pretty, pretty, pretty pieces. I like the really deep ruby red a whole lot. That's beautiful. Ooh, I just found the leak. I was looking for it. I came here for it. Right, let's see. There's a there was one particular pattern I hope was hoping would still be here. Oh my god, it's so gorgeous. I found the Lalik. Oh goodness, goodness, goodness. So, I already have pieces of this pattern. The, um, it's actually called Anemone, believe it or not. I bought some in California. I bought the candlesticks. And in their pictures, I saw that they had these matching pieces. And so now, oof what to do. Uh, these are not half price, but they will wheel and deal with me. Lalique is just the most stunning glass. The quality is just like no other, and it's always etched. You can see the signature under here. It's an etched signature, and it will say Lalique right there on it. Mm. I wish I could buy it all. I really do. It's one of my favorite types of glass, but it is super, super expensive, as you can imagine. Oh, man, oh man, what to do, because I want some. All right, I'm going to see how good of a deal they'll make me, especially on these pieces here. Always remember to look up. Oh my gosh, that is, I didn't even know in the pictures that it was Amberina. Oh, how stunning are those pieces right there? Love that. The light shining through that. Oh my gosh, that would be amazing. All right, we struck a deal on the Lalique. Okay, made a deal. Four pieces of that Lalique for $1,000. I had to remember where I put. Oh, it looks like somebody's been looking under my blanket here. But all right, I gotta go take this up front and get it written up.
I just spent $1,300 at that sale. And a thousand of it was the Lalique, but I got four amazing pieces of Lalique that match the candle holders that I got in California. So now I have like a whole set of the same pattern of Lalique. And you know when you have a whole set of something, you can increase the value by 20% of what you would get individually on high caliber items like that. So, and then Harley, you got a little piece of Lalique too. You got, you got a bird? I got a bird. She got a bird. It's beautiful. I love the Lalique birds. I love Lalique. It's one of my favorite. I, I'm still waiting to find some Lalique out in the wild, like at a thrift store. It's probably not gonna happen because it's pretty distingu distinguishable glass. Um, anyway, that was a whole lot of fun. Met several of my viewers there. So if you stopped and said hi to me, please leave a comment below so I can say thank you and, and hi once again. And with that, I think we're calling it a day. Uh, this has been a very, very profitable morning for everybody. Mm. And uh, gotta love yard sale season in Vegas. It is something else. All right, everyone. With that, go be profitable. And make it fun. Make it fun. See you on the next one.